This is life with two toddlers, guys. We have to make sacrifices around here if we want to do something. Got for both of the girls. Oh my god, you will want to. So this is what it looks like. Look how disgusting this is. Okay, dinner's done. Here's Sophia's dinner. Hot dog. <laughs> Brush your teeth. Okay. <laughs> Here. Good morning everyone. Um, I'm actually about to go down and get my workout in. Gage is home for the morning, um, but he goes back at noon. So it's, what time is it? Nine o'clock right now and I'm gonna go down and get my workout in. No pre-workout this morning because I actually haven't even finished my coffee yet we're kind of having like a slow morning um but it's thursday today i want to get my workout in and then well, i actually have a little bit of an old navy haul for the girls to share with you guys today we ordered some stuff recently that just came in and i want to show you all of it so that will be a little bit later on in the vlog but other than that i'm gonna bring you guys along for the day um, but i'm just gonna do my bike workout today um, it's been super gloomy here and stuff, so I think we're just going to stay inside today. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. We actually cleaned up our workout space this weekend, our whole like downstairs home gym. Um, so it's pretty clean down here, which feels nice to work out in a clean space. But I'm just going to do the bike um, probably 30 to 40 minutes today. Um, I don't want to do it too long because I don't want to waste the whole morning while Gage is home. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna use my sweet sweat too. Sweet sweat band. Take down your walls and let me ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, break by break now, let me ooh, ooh, ooh. I wanna be red and I got done with my workout and I'm about to take a shower, Sophia hung out with me while I worked out today, but we just got a package in the mail from my friend Michelle over on Instagram. I'm not sure if she watches my YouTube videos, but we're really good friends on Instagram, and she sent a little gift for Sophia's birthday. Her birthday's on Monday, actually. Yeah, she sent you a Barbie doll, a Chelsea doll, and a little ice cream kit, so I just thought that was so sweet. Sophia was so happy. Her reaction was just the cutest thing ever, but um, she said thank you, right? It's a cute doll. Did you name her? Yeah. What's her name? She's, this dog is Marshmallow. Oh, yeah, that's a good name. And this one's Shiloh. Oh, Shiloh? Wow, that's a cute name. <laughs> Where'd you get that? Shiloh and Marshmallow. I like that. You're the best at coming up with names. You guys already know I'm having my Kodiak waffles for breakfast. Uh, Mila is napping, by the way, so that's why I was able to shower and everything and uh, do my hair and... Um, a little bit of makeup not really just my brows but i'm gonna have breakfast and then sophia wants to go outside but i do want to give you guys a haul of all that old navy stuff that i told you about i just ordered some like summer stuff and sophia's in this stage right now where she only likes to wear pink because they're barbie clothes so literally every outfit that she wears has to be pink <laughs> so i had to order some more stuff so that she would actually get dressed without putting up a fight so i will do a haul of all of that Hopefully in a little bit I will get the chance to do that hopefully before Mila wakes up from her nap. She's been napping from around like 10, 11 depending on the time till like 1 in the afternoon which has been so nice. Um, and then at night she's been doing so good like I gave you guys that big update last time. But last night I woke up at like 4 super, not super engorged but like my boobs were so full because she went pretty much the whole evening up until the morning without feeding she's basically been going to sleep and not feeding until around 4 or 5 a.m so she didn't feed her first feeding till 5 a.m so we're pretty much like getting there um but i already talked all about that with you guys in my last vlog but yeah i was like leaking milk i had to change my shirt at four o'clock in the morning um but yeah i'll give you guys that haul here in a little bit i got some really Cute stuff from Old Navy for both of the girls. Okay, quick haul of everything that I got the girls from Old Navy. I think some of the stuff they already wore, um, but most of it is here. But let's start. Okay, this is one of my favorite things that I got. So again, Sophia's loving dresses right now. She basically only wears dresses. And I saw this tutu dress on Old Navy. The pattern is like a blue. Um, 
it's just so pretty for spring like a blue and pink and yellow floral and the bottom is like tutu-y and Sophia loves tutus right now as well we have so many of them so this is the first one and then i also got this in um two other colors one for mila and one for sophia this one's for sophia um but sophia got like another just light pink one that's actually in the wash because she already wore it it's in the dryer right now so it's just this in like a light pink i will link everything down below though if you want to purchase and then i got mila a yellow one because i just feel like this color suits Mila so much. I got Sophia this dress. This is her Barbie dress because this one's pink and striped and I thought she would love this one. It does have like some frill little um, pieces here at the top and then it's just like a striped pattern and it's kind of like a longer dress which she loves. My battery just died so I had to change it but Sophia just put on one of the dresses. She's gonna show you. Here, show them your dress. This is another one that I got for both of the girls. Um, I got Mila one too. So this is what it looks like. I think these ones were like $8. Um, like a plain, not tie-dye, but kind of like that. Like watercolor dress, I guess you could say. And it's got like tank top spaghetti straps. Just so cute, so comfortable, and just like a cotton dress for them. But Sophia is wearing hers today. Let me see. Beautiful. <laughs> I wear mine today. Yes, you are. So cute. I picked them each up a pair of biker shorts. This, these ones are actually in the same pattern as that uh, first dress that I showed you, but these are from Mila. And then this, I guess, isn't really spring or summery, but for those cooler like summer days or spring nights or whatever, I thought this was cute. And I got this in a big size. It's way bigger, but I feel like it will shrink in the dryer. But I thought it would go really cute with these biker shorts. So the biker shorts and then this like sweater it says we shine together on it and it's just blue and colorful and i thought they would look so cute together and i did get sophia a pair of pink barbie Whoa. biker shorts yeah so cute they're just plain pink and they'll go with a lot of different things but i love the biker Mila shorts for the girls i also love old navy's t-shirts for the girls so i did get them each a three pack of t-shirts they're just so comfortable so this first set comes with um a pink one which again i knew she would love so it's like a more neon pink color and then it came with ones with watermelons on it so cute just so plain and simple with a pair of shorts like what they usually wear throughout the summer and then this one has like polka dots um and it's like a peach color so those three came together and then mila got a different three but one of them she actually already wore so i'll show you the first two this set came with this pink one it's polka dots a white one and then it also came with like a blue floral colored one which i'll have linked i also got mila this really cute dress lots of dresses in this haul but this one's like a plaid pattern it's got some of my favorite colors for the girls in um just like pink and peach and yellow so cute but it's got this like knotted tie at the front and then in the back it kind of is like um separated so cute and then it flows out at the bottom um and it's also in like a linen material but i really love this one i did get them both some pajamas which again they already wore but they were basically the same set so um i love like old navy's t-shirt pajamas t-shirts and shorts are the best for the girls to wear at night so i did get them um this set they both got this one it's like a blue floral perfect for spring and then this is the top and then i got this one um it's like a cotton candy like tie-dye i thought the colors were so pretty and then again same with the matching shorts for pajamas i got them each a pair of sweatpants for like the cooler summer nights i just love having sweatpants for them but these were only seven dollars a pair so i got them each one um they're in like a it comes off really red on the camera but i think it's more like a rusty red so those ones are for mila and then i got the same ones for Sophia, um, my girls are in a size 3T and 5T, so I can pretty much get them all of the same clothes. And then I just got Mila a pair of plain jean shorts. These are actually like stretchy, more like linen-y type jean shorts, like denim shorts. So cute, but these ones are for Mila. I sized up to a 4T in these, Why but they have the them? elastic. And the last thing I got them was a right. pair of socks, which again, they already wore, but I just got them like a package of socks. Right which I always feel like I have to repurchase because they go through socks so quickly and they lose them. Um, but that's all that I got from Old Navy for them. Again, everything's going to be linked below. Um, and if I forgot to share anything, I will have it linked for you just so that you can purchase anything. Um, but that's my little Old Navy haul. And yeah, I hope you guys like that. But um, 
I thought the stuff was just so cute and they have some really cute spring and summer stuff and they also were having a 25% or 30% sale but they're always having sales so if they're not having a sale I would give it like a couple days or even a week and they will have one at some point just check in every day but I never buy Old Navy full price because they usually always have a sale oh no this club has to take a tag I'll take a tag off this one. Right, drawer. Put those in your uh, shirt drawer. Alright. And those drawer. go in your pants drawer. This one. Good job. And now we gotta clean up your room. She changed dresses again, by the way. Now we put the pink one. Here. These ones. Oh, you want them there? Yeah. Okay. I want them right here. Okay. I want the pillow right there so we have a wax and walk. You can relax? Yeah. And then those ones. And these ones go in my spot. Okay. And what about your pink blanket? Yep. I'll put it on here. Perfect. <laughs> Let me see. Wow, you did a great job. Yeah. Now my... Your, your room is so clean. So my plan for today, hopefully, if not tomorrow, I am going to um, hand vacuum my chairs because they get kind of gross from the kids. If I had the option, I would not have fabric chairs. It was a mistake and a bad idea, especially with kids. So I have to do this every once in a while, um, but I want to get them clean. So we're going to use our little Bissell handheld like shampoo or vacuum. Actually, I might do this right now while Mila's asleep. I don't think this thing is too loud. Sophia is having a lunchable or snackable as she likes to call it for lunch. Yeah, um, I brought it for Yeah, my sister bought it for her. We usually don't buy lunchables, but these look good. Chicken nuggets, Pringles, not very healthy, but <laughs> she's excited about it. So I'm going to make this for her for lunch today while I um, finish doing these chairs. The thing is like really loud. The um, shampooer, so I'm trying not to wake Mila. You want barbecue sauce or ketchup? Um, ketchup. Ketchup? Yeah. Okay. Ketchup, chicken nuggets. Oh, I got little Oh, and chips. There you go. But it doesn't get all of the stains out, but the difference is immaculate. So <laughs> there's one chair. Um, I tried getting all these little paint stains out and stuff, but sometimes it just doesn't happen. So I'll have to try it like hand washing it but I only did two chairs so far I'll probably wait until Mila's done napping to finish because it is like too loud it is 12 45 Mila is still asleep so I'm gonna make myself an iced coffee Gage texted me and said that he put in a target drive-up order for literally like one or two things which actually I need to add pinata candy to I'm not sure if he's gonna grab it after work or um, or if he wants me to grab it but I have to ask him, but I'm making a simple oat milk iced coffee and then I'm just putting a splash of my salted caramel. Really simple coffee today because I don't want anything crazy and I was gonna go pick up coffee, but I'm gonna be good and not get any out today. That looks so good. So we are trying the TikTok experiment. Mila's drinking the water. Oh my goodness, here. Here's yours, okay? They're blown away. What we're gonna do is we're gonna dip them in and I think, according to TikTok, the flowers don't come off. Dip the top of it in, in the water. This yeah, now take it out. Oh, look, see, they're still fluffy. <laughs> that kind of worked. Let's try it, this one Let didn't. me try it. Okay, you gotta dip the top of it in, see if it works. It's Just, no, other side. This side? Dip it in and see if the, <gasps> look, it poops back up. It's science. It's science. That's so cool. Look at yeah getting them each a snack now that they're in from outside and um i'm gonna give them some water too and i put on the tv finally um so 
that I have a little bit of time, so they're just having some like rest time. Who wants a red bowl and who wants yellow? I want a red one. You want a red bowl? Here's your water. And me this water. Chairs are done, but look how disgusting this is. That's what came out of my chairs. But all of them are clean. They look a thousand times better. There's, this one's like stained with paint or something that the girls got on it, but it is um, done. So now I'll have like time for them to dry. Um, they'll be dry by like probably the end of the day, but it looks so good. But this is literally disgusting. I had to show you guys. And I had a yogurt all over here. What did you do? I put a yogurt all over here. My poor child. Her sister did that. Sophia, now Mila has to get in the shower. Why did you do that? This is life with two toddlers, guys. This is life with two toddlers. I swear this happens at least once a day, something like this. Okay, they're both in the tub now, but I don't even know how I could get mad at that because she said she made her sister into a yummy cake with a cherry on top. That was yogurt and a fruit snack. <laughs> oh my gosh, but um, I did tell her that we cannot put food on our sister's head. I guess at least I got to wash my chairs. We have to make sacrifices around here. <laughs> if we want to do something, something like that was bound to happen. I've been out walking on a rougher patch now. But I must say, living on the edge of things has been kind of fun. We have regular broccoli or we have broccoli that has um, cheese sauce on top. What do you want? That one. This one? Okay. So we have a super simple dinner going on for the girls. It's five o'clock, Gage still isn't home. I have no idea what Gage and I are eating for dinner, but Sophia asked for hot dogs. So that is what the girls are getting and then I'm gonna make them some hash browns on the side and I have broccoli in the microwave that Sophia chose. She's cutting their hot dogs right now, just turkey, regular turkey hot dogs, so. Super simple, that made my life pretty easy tonight. Um, I guess they're having, not an early dinner, we usually eat pretty early, but Gage doesn't get home till around like 5.30, 6 some night, so we usually don't eat till around 6. I did take out some burger meat for Gage and I, maybe he'll wanna grill up some burgers, um, and we can just have like kind of like a grill night or something. Keep it really simple, I need mustard. All right, their dinner's done. Here's Sophia's dinner, hot dogs. Your potato is hot, okay? And then here's Mila's, I guess they're eating in the living room. Oop. Um, hot dogs, hash, half a hash brown for each of them, and some broccoli. It is much later now. It's actually 8.30 right now. Both of the girls are asleep. I'm cleaning up from dinner. I'm going to do the dishes, even though I really don't want to. Um, I'm just putting some leftovers away. But uh, we did do our Target drive-up order, and then we put the girls to bed. They fell asleep, so I think he's got a charger because he broke his phone charger. Or I don't know if he broke it, know, but the his piece and his phone broke, so he had to get like a portable one or like a cordless one. Did you try it? No, did you like lay it down? Oh, that's cool. Let me try it on my phone. It works with a case. Okay. Oh wait, <laughs> mine's already charged. Dude, you double charged? Yeah. Oh, there you go. It's just yeah, you have to hold it in the right spot. That's cool. But that's going to be it for today's video. Um, I don't think I'm going to talk to you guys again before Sophia's birthday party. I don't think I'm going to film Sophia's birthday party, but I will be posting a lot of it probably on Instagram and taking a ton of pictures. So follow me over on Instagram if you guys want to see that. I guess that's it. Next time I talk to you guys, I'll probably have a four-year-old. So that's crazy. But uh, thank you guys for watching today's video. Please don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Things has been kind of fun. Look, there's a booze right here. One or a few on there.